Well, welcome back, my friends. I am so excited to be here with Courtney Spurgeon. She is Development Manager slash Events and Volunteers, um, overseeing all that for One World Community Health Centers. Courtney, thank you so much for joining me today. Yes, absolutely. Thanks for having me. Well, we're going to learn a little bit about um, One World. Uh, we'll also talk about the Milagro Dinner that's coming up here um, just in a few weeks. So, um, but let's let's talk a little bit about One World um, Community Health Centers. Been around for for quite a while, and you do so much in the community. But kind of give us an overview. Yeah, so we are a nonprofit, federally qualified health center in the Omaha Metro. We have um, just over 16 clinical locations all throughout Omaha. And then the furthest we get from Omaha is Plattsmouth. Um, that includes five school-based health centers. Okay. Um, and our mission is to provide culturally respectful quality healthcare with special attention to the underserved. So about half of our patients have no form of health insurance whatsoever. Um, and we have approximately 50,000 patients annually. Oh. Yeah. Um, that's just patients, not visits. <laughs> the visits is yeah. a lot more than that. Um, so about 25,000 uninsured patients we um, care for every year. Yeah. And I think also, again, so important um, for the community and for those people. And I know one of the things with um, this event coming up, it uh, I mean, it's, it's a fundraising event. And, um, and I mean, I've been to it several times. But let's talk a little bit about the dinner and it's coming up on, I'm, I'm, I'm looking over here because I've got your website up. Um, Number 10. The 10th, oh my gosh, the 10th, down at the Marriott Capital District. So so fill us in on, on the event itself. Yeah, so it's Milagro, that's the Spanish word for miracle. Um, so we celebrate the miracles made possible by our community partners, volunteers, um, even patients sometimes. So that's, it's super fun and it's an awards dinner and silent auction. Um, so it's our biggest fundraising event of the year. Yeah. And you also have a keynote speaker or a speaker at this event. And I was actually reading about her. Do you want to tell us uh, a little bit about this amazing woman? Yes. We're so excited. Dr. Michelle Rosen. She is an author and a frequent guest on major media outlets um, in the United States. And she is an expert on the psychology of change. Mm -hmm. So our theme this year is moving forward. And so we thought she would be a great match to kind of speak to how do we move forward and what does change look like? Um, we've all had to deal with a lot of change the past two years that yeah. we didn't even have time to think about. And now as we move forward, we can actually be a little bit more intentional and take a deep breath. Okay, how, how do we process this change now um, moving forward? And so she's going to use her expertise on the psychology of change to speak to that. Yeah. And like you said, I mean, I, you know, I'm glad you said this because I, I, you know, I've thought about this, but not recently. I mean, the change that we've experienced over the last two years, I mean, it just happened. I mean, there was no preparing for it necessarily. <laughs> I mean, sometimes you're like, I'm going to be changing things. So you go into it with a strategic plan and you know what, you know, you're going to be doing and, or kind, you know, somewhat know what you're going to be doing, but really the change that's happened also, especially in healthcare, um, it, it's, it's, it, you, it's not anything that it was two years ago, two and a half years ago. It's just, we've had to adapt like quickly, uh, almost on a daily, sometimes almost hourly basis, really. Yes. <laughs> so, so she's going to be, again, I'm, I'm glancing over here. Um, there's, there's so much information um, on the event and, and yeah, this is really, she's going to be a great speaker. So um, yes. where can people buy tickets at? Um, Oneworldomaha.org slash Milagro. And Omaha.org slash Milagro. No. Um, and again, we, I know the, the, there's awards that evening. So can you talk a little bit about the people being honored? Yes, we have a very dynamic group. Um, they are listed on our event website, but they include a church group, a physician group from UNMC, um, a board member and a patient. 
So they comprise many different aspects of what it means to partner and build community with One World. So we're really excited about that. There'll be a uh, like a seven minute video that really meets them at their pl- like places of work yeah. or service. Um, that's going to be really, I think, touching during yeah. the program for everyone to see. It's always so inspiring um, to really hear from the people being honored and and learn about their journey, whatever it may be, and how, um, you know, and how, first of all, how they came to be honored and really kind of what's up in in their world, um, I think inspires all of us every time we see those. So, yes, well, it's going to leave everyone just feeling very uplifted and inspired. Yeah. So, so lastly, if, if people can't attend the event, what are some ways that they can support um, support uh, One World? Yeah, so we always accept monetary donations on our website, oneworldomaha.org. Um, what's really fun about our event this year is we actually have one raffle item that you don't have to be present to win. Okay. So it is rare aged Buffalo Trace Kentucky Straight Bourbon Whiskey. Okay. Um, got donated. Super exciting. It's um, five bottles worth uh, a couple thousand dollars each. So for all the bourbon wow. out there, yeah. buy a raffle ticket online. They're on sale now and you don't have to be present to win. Um, that's the only thing you don't have to be present. So that's fun. Yeah. And then we can always use more help with volunteers and in-kind donations. Um, the only in-kind donations we accept are baby boutique items. Okay. So diapers, baby wash, things like that. And people can um, email me directly to coordinate that. Yeah. Information. And I'll say with the holidays coming up, I mean, also this is 365 days a year, but it's kind of fun to have, you know, if you're with your business, um, corporation or whatnot, you can have a a little drive, a holiday drive to, and then specifically for one world and, um, people can connect with you to figure out how to drop off items. So yes, exactly. Yeah. And I can even supply posters to place at oh my goodness a okay church or a location that helps list you know what do we accept okay cool. that's that's awesome Courtney thank you so much for joining me today and um thank I know this is going to be a huge success once again and just appreciate everything you're doing and one world um, community health center is so important for our community so thank you again thank you